everyone, and welcome to the first episode of a new game called uh, Nuclear Throne. I haven't really played this game yet, but uh, I'm willing to give it a try. I'm playing with keyboard and mouse, and as you can see, I put uh, auto aim off because auto aim is for pussies. So let's see what this game is all about. It's uh, it's a rogue-like uh, game made by Vlambeer Studios. Uh, Another Dutch company, so yay, National Pride. And while I was explaining this, I've already beaten the first level. So it's uh, it's pretty much an uh, action-adventure style, point-and-click, kill everything. It's it's like Diablo, um, except I only seem to have two skills at this point, but uh, that might be more in the future. Let's see, so it seems it's a kill-and-gather-everything game and then a portal opens and you can go to the next world. So far so good, I heard this game is almost impossibly hard. Just like uh, pretty much any Flumber game, you know, if you have played Super Crate Box or Aloof Drowsers, those are both insanely hard as well, especially if you unlock the hidden difficulties. Um, so, so far so good, I've just been hit for the first time. It didn't insta-kill, I was sort of expecting insta-kill for some reason. And uh, here's the first boss. It's a big bandit. Yes. Alright. Uh, let's just keep shooting these bastards until everything explodes and then go into the hole. Ah. I seem to have some shotgun ammo, but I don't have a shotgun. I can only hold two weapons at once. I like the machine gun because it has a ton of bullets, and I like the crossbow because it almost insta-kills everything. And actually pierces. Piercing shots are awesome in, in games like this because uh, generally there will be at one point a corridor with a million enemies in a row, and you can just shoot one arrow and boom, everything dead. So, so far so good. Let's see what we got. Um, currently in a sewer level. So we'll remember the corridor stuff I just said because that's go. Oh yeah, look at that! I just shot four guys with a single arrow. Okay, got some explosives as well. Um, no, I don't want a wrench. I have ammo. I'll, I'll get melee weapons when I run out of ammo, I guess. So I'm doing the daily challenge mode. Um, probably not the smartest idea to start your first playthrough with a daily challenge mode. But hey, what are you going to do about it? Um, so now I'm in the, now I'm in, the, in Chrono Trigger's uh, 2100 AD. <laughs> this is the protodome. At least that's that's what I feel with it. I'm not sure if that's what the artist was going with, but um, hey, correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, these robots explode. Have to be careful with that. Otherwise, not much of a threat here. Or and I got blown up instantly by a car. Great! So that's my first playthrough of um, this awesome game, Nuclear Throne. Check it out, it's on Steam. It's still in development, but it already looks pretty awesome. Uh, I'm intending to make more videos of this. I'll probably play some normal mode next, so if you enjoyed this, please comment, like, subscribe. You know the deal, and I'll see you around next time. Bye!